Validating probe scans and automation approach. Sir Tim Berners-Lee, inventor of the internet, says, data is a precious thing and will last longer than the systems themselves. The web as I envisioned it, we have not yet seen it. The future is still so much bigger than the past. Remember our eight ways of the 20th century. Defects, overproduction, waiting, unused talent, transportation, inventory, motion, and extra processing. Remember our seven frictions of the 21st century. Flux, inventory, volume, errata, waiting, defects, and mismatch. Let's go ahead and use our probe scan. Assuming that you are going to do your first probe scan with your own human computer, your, your eyeballs, go ahead and use the full scan DFFP cycle view that you see here. We're going to use the columns from both probe coverage and probe result. And then let's look at how we can actually find if there is 20th century or 21st century challenges, problems, wastes, or frictions. In our example, let's use our, our farmer example. Test 1.1.12 talks about substrate temperature monitor reset to tolerate a two degree variation. If we were able to get 50% of this particular purpose statement covered by the probe, our own analysis, and we found that there was a mismatch in the business rules, the expectation that there would be an increased throughput of CHO cells, perhaps that mismatch would be identified here in this probe. Let's go ahead and pause here and actually take a look at both 20th century waste and 21st century frictions. Look at your list of tests and ask yourself, test by test by test, what is a probe result or what could a potential probe result be if there is a friction there or a waste there? And please capture that in the column associated here. Let's go ahead and do that for all of our purpose statements, all of our tests. Please take the time to do that now. An example of a pass of a probe, a, pr a successful probe that leads to a successful pass score, would be if all of our tests are green, we do a, a probe scan considering both frictions and waste, and we find no frictions and no waste. Then it's a pass. It's successful. If we find that we can only do a probe scan of a small portion of a purpose statement for whatever reason, then if we find a friction or waste, we identify it, we know that we can highlight that and for our next cycle log based on the next one month, two month or three month period, we can actually address that going forward. Please find and then identify potential waste and frictions that may be a result of just not able to have, you know, full coverage of that particular problem statement or that purpose statement. Okay, so let's do that now. Let's do that probe. Okay, let's move on.